What's going on guys? So today I'm starting this video at the end rather than the beginning. Well, I'm not even at the end yet, but basically what I mean is, um, for those who don't know, I moved in with Ash in the beginning of the month. The reason for that was to be more productive. Uh, that has worked. Ash also wanted to change his lifestyle. That has also worked. So when me and Ash moved in together, we kind of started filming from the get-go, but had no sense of direction where it was going. I knew what I wanted to do, but I didn't know how I was going to do it. Now we're reviewing the footage. I'm just going to turn it into a massive vlog of what I've been up to for the last month. Uh, nothing too exciting, just food shopping, uh, training, living around the house, being with me, which is probably... Worst thing I've ever gone through. Yeah, um, but I think I think it's a love-hate relationship. Um, so I'm wearing a hat, by the way, because my mop is absolutely terrible at the moment. Uh, we're getting our haircuts tomorrow. I'm taking Ash to my barber, Jacob. Shout out, Jacob. i um, going to get our hair and beard done. Well, Ash is going to get his fluff and his face done. Um, it's fine. <laughs> Tonight, uh, tonight's Thursday the 24th, and uh, we had a bit of a cheeky night off. Uh, we went and saw the new Dragon Ball Z, because we're that cool. I hope you can be as cool as us. Um, for those who don't know, I'm a massive Marvel fan, and that started by being a massive Dragon Ball Z fan to begin with. Uh, I'm not into any other anime. It's literally just Dragon Ball Z and some stuff on Pornhub. Um, no, I'm joking. <laughs> um, so yeah, uh, and the reason why I've got my top off is because I don't like wearing clothes and that is the honest truth. How much do I, how many times do you see me wearing clothes? Like within a respectable level, not like... Um... This has gone weird. <laughs> this has gone sexual. No, honestly, I don't like wearing clothes. If it, I don't care if it's snowing outside. In, if I'm inside, the heating goes on. I don't wear clothes. Like I don't like wearing yeah, clothes. Yeah, the heating does go on. I guess who pays for it? <laughs> I'm contributing. So yeah, like and subscribe and I hope you enjoy the video. Let's go. On time, boy. On, what's this section? What? What's this, this section? The fruit and veg section. Nah, it's news to me, mate. I'll show, I'll show you guys a tip, right? These bananas here are dead bananas. You don't want these dead bananas, bro. You want to go with them. You do not want to do that. <laughs> you want to get in here. And these are the fresh ones, mate. Well, that, that's not fr fresh. That, well, that's not fresh. They're fresh on them. We have, what's this? The state of that? Oh, oh so, mate. Oh. Um, Mouldy lemon, melon. What? Did we just become best friends? Yup. <laughs> melon. Right. From my experience. The best apples. Well, they're not the best apples, but I, I just find these. They, they've got a good consistency and they taste well. High in fibre. And they're a good source of fat. Also, three quid, mate. That's three bars of galaxy. No, no, mate. Well, we're not on that galaxy hype anymore. Sorry. No, but I love chocolate. No, no chocolate. These are. Chicken sausage and these are all fucking great macros in them, look. Right, so per two grilled sausages you're getting 1.7 grams of fat, but you're getting 18 grams of protein. And you get 10 in there. Good value for money. Get two then. Yeah? Yeah. So I normally get these because they're already cut and I can't be fing bothered to like faff about cutting it. And I don't like the chicken slime. What's in what? Sparse man, look! That's it. Oh, I'm gonna be showing up to No! Right, you get them on? Yeah. This is expensive pre-packed stuff, bro. You don't want to buy anything. Oh, wait, bro. One, one thirty-five. Does it not on video lost? That's not even a whole melon there, mate. One thirty-five. You're paying for convenience, bro. <laughs> Why? Salt oil. This is what I live on. Oh yeah, hell yeah. No, I live on it. Like, right. So look, it's got per hundred mil. So this bottle's two hundred twenty. 0 0.9 of fat, 1.1 1 .1 of um, carbohydrates. The only thing is high salt, but salt ain't part of your macros, is it? Now, I buy these rices. Let me tell you again, I split these into two meals. I'll show that later in another video, but they are, you are paying for convenience with these, because they are a quid, and you can get, like, what, this? What? Which is just that tip of Yeah, but flavour, there's no flavour in that. But that, oh, I can't it's even dead. imagine, I can't even imagine how many servings you'd get out of that. You'd get probably, <laughs> this whole aisle, um, <laughs> £1.59, so yes, I am, I am being un, what's the right, I'm not spending wisely with rice, but I can't be bothered to cook it, and like you just said, it's long, and this is easier to track macros, because it's all written on the back, as for, I get these, and these are proper cheap, one quid, and you get 20 of these, like, um, vitamin C, 1000 MG, your, your body doesn't, your body doesn't use a thousand MG. You will piss the rest out. Now, you probably won't want to do this. I get tuna and I eat out of tin. What? 
Or just normal tuna? Just get tuna and I eat at the chin. Chin? At the chin? At the chin. At yeah, the chin. your chin. I get these. This is, um, I, got, I started eating these because of Joe Delaney. He gets these ones, but we don't earn as much money as Joe Delaney, so we've got to stick to the one pound ones. <laughs> <laughs> Two of these are pretty quick. And I, I have this every morning. Every morning. With what? I put it a uh, skim of yo protein and um, milk. I think I'll. Should we, should we change from cow milk to almond milk or what? <laughs> I ain't got almond money, mate. <laughs> yeah, I got almond money. I know. <laughs> well, most definitely not be having cooking dough flavoured milkshake. Sound like a pussy. <laughs> is, that, is that what good pussy sounds like? <laughs> it's a switch to almond milk. I have always promoted that I don't think cow milk is normal. It needs but yeah, I drink milk. it all the time, so. New year, new milk. Oh yeah, thirty pound, yeah. Yeah, we're no worries then. Oh, he's stealing! Oh, <laughs> he's stealing! This food shop comes to fifty-two quid, and that is quite dear for the week. Um, it normally would be a lot cheaper. Normally, I could build about thirty, but I bought loads of other stuff that, as for moving in with Ash, I have to buy towards stuff I'd normally. I would normally buy it, but it wouldn't do in my, my weekly shop. I'd normally buy it in wholesale, so that's where the difference in cost has come from. So me and you are on the way to Five Guys now for our final supper. The last supper. The last supper. The last supper. Because if I catch Ash eating any shit when we're on this diet thing and this new new 2019 wavelength, there's going to be fucking trouble. <laughs> <laughs> so, no, because I want results. I can't. I can't cheat. Otherwise, it's not going to be organic. It's not just about. It's not just about like. If you can stick to that kind of mindset of eating healthy, you can stick to a mindset of like doing other shit that's positive. So just getting up earlier, being more productive with your stuff. So once you get into a routine of doing stuff, it it kind of leads on with other shit that you're doing throughout your day. So I just feel like if you're eating healthy, your healthy mind, healthy diet, and then you get a healthy kind of work, like. I know what I mean, and I think you guys know what I mean, but... Work ethic. There we Work go. Ethic. That's it. Teamwork. See, see, teamwork there. Like, so yeah, so if you're eating healthy, healthy healthy diet, healthy mind, then you get good work ethic from that as well, because you're in a routine. I, just feel, I feel like it is what the, the core you did? trying to be successful, not that I am successful yet. Ooh, you're hard, showing off. Cut the sh That's where I live. I live in the not not in the hood. I live in the wood. <laughs> <laughs> Can I get a bacon cheeseburger, please? Yeah. <laughs> Is these all the toppings? Yeah. Yeah. Got all in. Oh, all, all the way, mate. Where Can I all the way, please? Everything in black. Yeah. Yeah, everything in black. And can I also get jalapeno peppers? Yeah. Green peppers. Yeah. Hot sauce. And relish. Please. Yeah, okay, all the way out to the Yeah, we are indeed. And can I also have little fries? Because if I can remember, you still get loads in there as well. Yeah. And a bottle of shrimp, please. So, it's the last day of eating shit, so we are going in, in and it has to be Fanta and grape. Grape family. Five Guys mayonnaise is a different tier. That's ketchup, bro. I know, we've got mayonnaise. That's ketchup, We've mate. got mayonnaise, we've got mayonnaise. You've got to get a monkey up. And they're free. And they're sort of protein. And fat. I don't actually know how long I'm going to eat this. Just zoom in on that. Wow. Right, let's see if I can get my gob brand in. Oh, good shot and burn. <laughs> That's the shit right there. Mm -hmm. Greg? Again, I'm running around with the team. So over the last month, I've been doing a lot of filming in the gym, uh, filming the workouts and stuff of push, pull and legs. But after reviewing the footage, it's not how in depth I wanted to go with it. I wanted to kind of explain what each workout does and it all looks a bit rushed 
and the last thing I want to do is put out rushed footage, especially when I'm trying to create good content. So instead, I'm going to turn it into a mashup of all three workouts. I've chose the best sessions out of the bunch, and I've put them together in a mashup. So that's what you're about to see now. Let's go to the park and take a mark. What's going on, guys? So tonight we're doing a push workout. We're in Chatham True Gym. A push workout consists of doing your chest, your shoulders, and your triceps. Uh, we're training with Ash, the guy behind the camera right now, and my boy Bill. Oh, they're both my boys though, ain't they really? Anyway, let's go. So me, Bill and Ash are in the middle of filming a pool workout and Ash has been called out to North London to do some filming for So Solid Crew, as you do. Um, so he's had to leave with the camera, so I'm left with my iPhone 10. It films in 60 frames per second in 4K, so it should be good enough quality to film it, but I wasn't gonna let him leaving with the camera stop us from doing it. So in case you're wondering why the change of quality, that's why. So this afternoon we're filming a leg workout. I'm here with Ash, he's on his phone, busy as per usual. And I'm here with Bill also. Bill's put me through the mill tonight as well because he's got bigger legs than me, so I've got to try and stick to his weight. Let's go. But Bill was adamant I've got to do them, so here we go. So we just got out from doing a push workout, it went really well, and the results Ash is getting is ridiculous. People tonight were coming up to him and saying, Boy, you look like you've lost a lot of weight, and uh -huh. he has. Uh, he's lifting more weight as well, which is always a good thing. Uh -huh. and he is. It just shows you what you can do when you're in a calorie deficit and you train and you're eating the right foods. Just pulled up to the barbers now, we're just about to go in. Ash has never been to my barber before. Shout out Jacob, he gets the freshest trims in Medway. What can I say? And uh, yeah, gotta get this boy a good haircut because that one is shit. <laughs> Twenty-seven hearts beat. 
Yeah, yeah, look at me, give us a look. Oh, okay, I'll get my hair cut. Why is it focusing you? Focus on me, bitch. <laughs> so that's a brief video of what I've been up to for the last month. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll catch you in the next.